From fixed Champions League draws to Premier League clubs poisoning each other's dinners, here are some of the biggest conspiracy theories in football. It was the final day of the 2005-06 season and Tottenham sat just one point ahead of their North London rivals Arsenal in the battle for a top four finish. On the day, Tottenham faced up against another rival in West Ham and all they needed to do to secure a Champions League spot was match Arsenal's result against Wigan. However, the night before the game, after eating a pre-match meal of spaghetti bolognese and lasagna, multiple Tottenham players became extremely sick. Lasagna and spaghetti bolognese were on the menu. We ate and in the middle of the night, we started dropping like flies. Lots of key players, including Michael Carrick, Robbie Keane, Edgar Davids, Aaron Lennon, and Michael Dawson were all affected, so Spurs requested to postpone the fixture. However, this request was declined, and manager Martin Yole was forced to field a team full of sick players, resulting in Tottenham losing 2-1. Meanwhile, Arsenal picked up a 4-2 win against Wigan, crushing Tottenham's Champions League qualification. But it doesn't end there. Much like a lasagna, this story has multiple layers. Many believe that this was no accident and that an Arsenal official had been sent to Tottenham's hotel in order to spike the club's lasagna. Others believe that the hotel chef must have been an Arsenal fan and decided to spike it. The Health Protection Agency launched an investigation into the London Marriott Hotel's lasagna following the claims and found no evidence, leading them to conclude that it was just a viral infection. For years there's been speculation around cup draws being fixed in football. There's theories about heated balls, squishy balls, heavy balls, even vibrating balls, allowing the person drawing them out to identify which ball represents each club. In recent history there's been a little bit of fishiness surrounding some Champions League draws. In the semi-finals of the 2017-18 Champions League, Liverpool were drawn against AS Roma. Seems pretty normal. Until you realise that Roma were advertising tickets to a Champions League semi-final against Liverpool on their official website a day before the draw even took place. They knew that they were going to get Liverpool. As you'd imagine, this page on their website was quickly taken down. Another clue to the draws being fixed in this season were UEFA's official Facebook covers, believe it or not. Before the draw for the 2018 quarter-finals, UEFA updated their Facebook cover image to this. The teams that were later drawn together are mirrored in this image. Sevilla got Bayern Munich, Juventus got Real Madrid, Roma got Barcelona and Manchester City got Liverpool. And this was also the case for the semi-finals too. Coincidence or a fix? Poor Roy Hodgson had a stinking time at Liverpool during the 2010-11 season and after just six months in charge, his job was under scrutiny. In January 2011, Liverpool were trading 3-1 away to Blackburn and Captain Fantastic himself, Steven Gerrard, had the chance to get his team back into the game from the penalty spot. And in abnormal Steven Gerrard fashion, he blazed it over the bar. Liverpool went on to lose 3-1 and Hodgson was sacked just days later. Many believe that Gerrard missed this penalty on purpose in order to get Hodgson sacked. This theory seems even more likely when you watch it back. Before absolutely levering the penalty into the stands, Stevie glances over towards Hodgson on the touchline. The way he takes the penalty is unrecognisable. He typically leans over the ball, striking them low and hard into the corners. But for this penalty, he nonchalantly leans back and sidefoots it into the stands almost as if he was doing it on purpose. Gerrard's also publicly said afterwards that there was an uncomfortable atmosphere playing under Hodgson, so this theory does make sense. 